I don't know if every company does this or not, but definitely I think everyone should, is having a hiring committee, um, which is really one of the people that approves roles. Especially in the early days, it's often common for that job to just be the CEO or just the finance person or just the HR person, but it should really be a committee for a few different reasons. One, it removes all the different biases that people may have when approved roles. Two, it makes sure that it encompasses or different points of views when it comes to departmental understanding, because finance might have a very specific understanding of the way a department works versus HR versus the CEO or the founders might have a different one. Um, and the third step and most important one in my eyes is it really removes any potential emotional frictions in the sense that the staffing plan process is a very emotional one for many leaders because that's the time where we tell you, yes, you're going to be well-staffed in the next quarter or no, you're going to have to survive with what you have right now, which sometimes was our fun conversations. And so making those decisions as a committee forces you to make sure that there's no one to point the fingers to. It's really you've all agreed as a group that this is what was best uh, for the organization. 